Ancient coins discovered near Thames River could rewrite London's history, according to archaeologists. The items were discovered on the southern bank of the river, where researchers previously found the remains of an Iron Age settlement. Post holes capable of holding a massive structure, and these are and other findings offer evidence of a bustling community with thriving ironworking industry. This is what Professor Alice Roberts, University of Birmingham, states. Coins discovered recently near the Thames River could rewrite London's history. Mike Curnow, archaeologist from Museum of London Archaeology, said, The general view in the scientific community is that London is a Roman city. Ancient Romans, as we know, had settled in uh, uh, England uh, and uh, has, as no substantial evidence of pre-Roman settlement has been found close to the city center of London we're talking about. The design of the coins discovered suggests that they were made for, for the Cantiachi tribe. It's an Iron Age Celtic people living in Britain before the Roman conquest. Scientists believe they lived in what is now Kent, that's south of London, and used Canterbury as their capital. Now, the findings fill, uh, filling is uh, filling uh, in the prehistory of London almost rewrites, and if you like, the idea that there's nothing going on in London before the Romans, but it, well, there was. Iron Age specialist Adam Sutton examined the items. He concluded that they were the earliest coins ever found in Britain. They had the maker's tabs, which means that an Iron Age mint could have been located in this area. Mr. Sutton said researchers are still debating the role of the coins in Iron Age society and whether it's been a monetized community. Well, if they had coins, obviously it was a monetized community. He said, it's uh, totally possible that the fact that we've got manufacturing evidence here means that people had to come and exchange the objects which they wanted to buy for what is effectively money. There's also potentially a ritual aspect that could potentially be intended for offerings. The river is very nearby, and we know that people liked to cast metal objects into the river as a ritual. I guess uh, that's before they started uh, tossing coins in the fountain. Ah, oh, I love Rome. Fontana di Trevi, where are you? This is by Max Gorgipachov Sputnik. Please leave your comments. Thank you for your support. I finally support my Patreon account. The daily posts are five videos daily, and they are totally different from what I have on my YouTube channel. Thank you so much for your support and that you find all my content so interesting. You'll find the Patreon account details in the description box.